is good John welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions I'm sorry for the lighting um, I'm facing against the sun this nigga watch look he gonna do it again he just keeps hitting my fucking car and I just told his ass like bro you just hit my door but anyway I'm not finna start this vlog off on a negative note even though that's some bullshit um, I have to go get gas, so let me go ahead and pull out of this parking lot before this nigga fucks around and hits my shit for real, for real, like, type, dunzo type, fucking dumbass, bro, like, that's, that's a reason why, that's one of the reasons why I don't like parking next to people, because when people get in their cars, bro, and they're not car enthusiasts like us, or they don't really care about their car, like we do then they just swing open their doors they don't care who's next to them they don't care what's next to them they don't care about nothing they just want to get out of the car and get in the house or wherever the hell they're going and i'm sorry about this little like five second rant but that really just pissed me off because when i told him that he hit my car did he say anything fuck no did he say sorry well, fuck no so it's like all right bet you know what i'm saying but it's cool though I got my alarm I was supposed to be in left the house um, It's cool though Because Like I say man You know what I mean I'm not finna let this Vlog start off on a negative note So With that being said What is up y'all Welcome back to yet again Another episode of J.I. Productions It's your boy J.I. You feel me If you're new to the channel Welcome to the channel I go by J.I. Um this is my 2011 Chevrolet Camaro um, and right now you're in for a treat because I got some things that I want to get off my chest and then there's a topic I know you see the title and the thumbnail there's a topic that I want to talk to you guys about and get your honest opinions because at the end of the day I'm telling you the same thing like I've been saying ever since I started this channel this channel is not just for me you know what I mean it's also for y'all so I want to make sure that I'm putting out the content that you guys want to see so with that being said let me go ahead and um, fill up with gas real quick and we will be on our way to this dealership to go look at a car and uh, I'm not gonna not gonna let you guys know what car it is and I'm going the wrong direction super okay so let me turn around <laughs> I'm not gonna let you guys know what car it is yet because I don't know if this deal is gonna go through if it's gonna fall through you never know you know what I mean and um, I don't want to one pull out my camera setup while I'm trying to test drive the car and have the person who's selling me the car, you know what I mean, trip out or get upset. You guys know how it goes. So, but what I did want to talk about, the topic of this video is basically, I want to know, before I go drop a bag on a car, you know what I mean? Everybody, I read the comments. I really read the comments, like for real. If you don't know, now you know. I read the comments, I try to reply to every comment, even the negative ones, even the stupid ones, the trolls, all that shit. I reply to every single comment. That's something that I have been doing since day one, and I pride myself on it. The fact that you guys are taking the time out of your day to watch my videos, not just watch them, like them, share them, drop comments on them, you know what I mean? It means a lot to me, so I feel like it's only right that I take time out of my day to not just edit and upload the video, but also respond and like every reply, um, and you know what I mean? Every comment I reply to, um, and everything, you know what I mean? So, that's just my little spiel to y'all, um, but basically what I wanted to talk about is, we've already got an understand, uh, understanding of you guys wanting me to stay with the camera. Um, like I said, the 5.0 has been on my bucket list for a minute, um, but everybody, everybody got upset in the comment section and just went ham and was like, hey, don't do it, please don't do it. Like there were some comments begging me not to do it. There were some comments saying, 
stick with the marrow, you know what I mean? Somebody said stick with the bow tie. <laughs> Shout out to you, bro. I don't really remember all the handles, but I remember the comments. So if you commented that, go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up or drop your um, your at name down in the comment section down below and say, oh, I did. I'm the one that did it type, you know what I'm saying? But right now, pulling into this gas station, um, finna fill up real quick and then we'll get straight into this topic let me just get gas real quick i'm gonna see you on 2.5 seconds all right you guys so back in the car now um let's go ahead and get this topic going real quick so basically sorry somebody let me in you know you gotta give them that nod and the smile and uh, keep it pushing <laughs> so basically what i wanted to ask you guys was everybody is so dead set on the camaro which is understandable because you know what i mean that's what that's what made my channel that's what made my name so i know that damn near 100 percent, if not like 99.9 percent .9 of you guys are here for the chevy gang not for the ford gang or the dodge gang Except that 1%, uh, bro, I, I remember. <laughs> I, you commented on my video, on the video, and was like, uh, switching over to Dodge, something like that. <laughs> nah, man, we're not doing that. But, at least not yet. Um, but, what I wanted to talk about was the transmission. Now, everybody, everybody in the car community is sort of, um, like, the deep, deep like really deep um car enthusiasts like are all sprung on this idea of if your car is not a manual um then it's not a fucking like it's not an actual muscle car or sports car or whatever the fucking case may be and it's like i get it i completely understand it but if somebody chooses to go the automatic route, who are you to, you know what I mean, judge them or get upset with them or talk mess about them or just discredit their build um, just because of the transmission that they have in their car? Like, I personally have had somebody literally tell me, oh, why don't you be a real man and get a manual? And I'm just like, bro, what? <laughs> Because I'm pretty sure... No, I'm not going to get into that. But, yeah, man. You know what I mean? So, I just wanted to know. If I got another automatic. Because, literally, y'all want me to stay with the Camaro. And I literally cannot find a manual 2014 SS. Or 2011. I find 2010s, 2011s, and 12s. But when I find them, it's either the deal breaks through or when i find the car it's already sold or it's not what it looked to be on paper on, on picture in pictures and or finally oh wow bro just got hit by a bike but last last but not least the deal that the person told me when we spoke over the phone or to my face is not the deal that they print out on the papers. You know what I mean? So it's just like it's been a tough it's been a tough battle looking for a manual and honestly I really want a manual, but I want to know if I was to get a manual, I mean, get an automatic. How would you guys feel? Because the car that I'm looking at, I'm going to go look at right now only has 13,000 miles, but it's an automatic. But it's like, it only has 13,000 miles. So that's a car that I know I will probably keep for a while. That's a car that I don't know, maybe on the channel, wink, wink, I would probably manual swap. You know what I mean? That's something that I know that's gonna have longevity. It's gonna last long because it only has 13,000 miles. That's fucking ridiculous, you know? So let me know down in the comment section down below. Um, would you guys 
want to see another automatic on the channel but you guys want me to take the manual route um and really and truly the manual route i would love to go manual because i don't know man i've had an automatic literally since i got my first car you know and they're fun i'm not gonna lie i mean it's 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 soothing knowing that you like really don't gotta do shit you just gotta press on the brake or the gas pedal and that's it you know what i mean especially in traffic times um but it's like i don't know man you know like i kind of want to change it up a little bit and i think that's why i wanted to go to the mustang um because it's a new platform and it's been on my bucket list for a while but the camaro came first so it's like you know i'm not gonna sit here and be like oh no i don't want a camaro you know that shit's not cool <laughs> like what the fuck i'm gonna get whatever it is that i can get and more you know so let me know down in the comments man if i got another automatic would you guys be ready to see that build would you guys be ready to see me potentially swap the automatic transmission for a manual transmission and I know that literally, 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 for some of y'all, this right here is the fucking deal breaker. If I don't have an, uh, a manual, some of you might leave the channel, some of you might not want to watch the channel, some of you might have your opinions, you know what I mean? And everybody's entitled to their own opinion, but you got to understand it from my point of view. I'm trying to play devil's advocate, I'm trying to make everybody happy, I'm trying to make sure that I'm happy at the same time, and make sure that the channel is doing well, because honestly, this YouTube channel is my first priority. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, and I do want to apologize for the lack of uh, uploads lately. School just started, man. I'm still working. It's just my schedule is super tight. Super, super tight. Um, and every morning that I plan to go shoot a video for you guys, I either get called into work or I'm just backed up with assignments, dude. Like, we... I have a lot of a lot of assignments for my classes you know what I mean and school is another major thing in my life right now you know what I mean I could care less about a job as far as like what I need to focus on right now and what I'm focusing on is school and YouTube you know what I mean the job like I'll be fine and that's why you save you know I can hold off on a job for a little bit and just keep doing what I'm doing but summertime is over you know what I mean J.I. Squad it's over so like that grind like it just got 10 times like 10 times tougher not tougher but it just multiplied by 10 times basically I got a lot that I'm juggling right now and I'm ready for it but I need you guys to let me know. I want that. I want our communication to be crystal clear. You know what I mean? I want it to be like looking through a clean ass window because I want to know what you guys want, and that way I can incorporate what I want, um, mix the two together, or we're both satisfied. The channel will do great. Um, numbers, like I've been looking at the numbers, man. We're pulling numbers every day, growing. It's, it's amazing. It's amazing. I literally just hit a thousand subscribers a couple months, like a month ago. And we're already at over 1,200 subscribers. It's crazy, man. And I just want to say thank you to you guys. Um, I wanted to come on here and update y'all. Let y'all know what's going on, why I haven't been uploading, um, where I am with this car search. Um, am I still looking at 5.0s? Honestly, let me answer that real quick, too, before I cut this video off. Um... Honestly, if a 5-0 came to me with a deal that I could not give up, I literally probably would pull the trigger. Same thing with the Camaro. In this case, I'm looking for a good deal. I'm looking for, oh shit. It's that time, boys.
was that? Oh yeah, okay, so what I'm looking for, man, I have literally like a list of things that I'm looking for that matter to me in the next build. And it's literally, I just want, I want it to be a manual. I really want leather seats because of my Husky, you guys know, Jules, she sheds everywhere. You know what I mean? If I show you guys my back seat right now, it's literally supposed to be black, it's white. It's ridiculous. So I want to get a manual transmission. I want to get leather seats. And if it, it doesn't matter if it's a Camaro or a Mustang, I really want to scream. I don't like this radio. And apparently, um, shout out to my homeboy. Bro told me that apparently over time, these radios, they start to like go out or something it's like they stop playing music or something like that i don't know it's weird um and yeah thankfully i haven't dealt with that issue in my specific car but i don't want to so with that being said i'm trying to get the screen because either way it go who doesn't want a fat ass screen in their car when they get in the car you know what i mean and if you know me you know that my interior is like one of the biggest things to me so let's go over this list real quick before i click off this camera because i'm about to pull it to the dealership a manual a v8 whether it be a 50 or a 6.2 i believe camaros are um or it has to have a screen um if it had a sunroof that's a plus my car literally just got a wash i don't know a pipe busted or something it's water everywhere great um if it's a manual that's cool if it has a sunroof that's an even bigger plus if you know me you know that literally every time i say every time i see a camaro with the sunroof i say the same thing every time dude if my car had a sunroof it would look so much more aggressive but it is what it is you know what i mean Ooh, that's a 2014 i wonder if it's an ss or a v6 i think it might be a v6 because i didn't see any badges but we'll stop by on the way back to the crib and look, for, look at it but right now um i'm about to pull up to the deal to the dealership i'm literally one minute away so that's going to be the end of this video um i really just needed to get these things off of my chest and ask you guys um your opinion because y'all already know y'all's opinion matters the most to me um as far as what i do with the channel um the real subscribers like the real ji squad um y'all's opinion matters to me but the trolls and shit, I can give a fuck about y'all. But we're pulling up to the dealership right now. Um, I'm not going to show you guys, like, the dealership or the address or none of that because I haven't gotten a check from them yet. <laughs> so we're pulling in. Um, probably going to park right here. Or no, I'll park in the back. That way I'm out of their hair and shit. But yeah, man. Let me know down in the comment section down below. If I don't get a manual, would you be upset? Um, if I got a manual, would you be happy? If I got a Mustang, would you really think about pressing that unsubscribe button? Um, and by the way, if you haven't already subscribed, make sure you smash that subscribe button. You do what I'm saying. And give this video a big thumbs up. But anyway, um, would you really unsubscribe to me? I don't know. Y'all let me know down in the comment section down below. But without further ado, the salesman's coming outside right now. So without further ado, it's been your boy, J.I. I'm going to see you guys in the next one. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Plus, turn on those post notifications. Um, it helps the channel out tremendously. I'm going to see y'all in the next one. I'm gone.